hi guys and welcome back to my channel so today i have a video for you that i've been wanting to do since christmas day but i haven't had a two minute spare to actually film it it is your stereotypical what i got for christmas video and i'm so excited to share with you what i got I'm absolutely surrounded by presents right now. I don't even know where to start. I just want to make that disclaimer that none of this is by any means me bragging or anything like that. I myself am really interested in what people got for Christmas. I love watching those videos and see what other people are actually into. So this is why I wanted to do this one, show you guys what I've been into, what I've been getting. I've been so, so lucky this year. I'm so entirely grateful for everyone who's bought me a gift and I'm so excited to share them with you. So without further ado, I'm going to get stuck into this mound that is around me right now. <laughs> so me and my little sister get each other gifts every year. We never really set a budget or anything but we seem to go haywire. We go off the radar. We're like she'd like that, she'd like that and that's kind of what we did this year by an accident but I'm so grateful for everything she got me so I'm going to show you. To start with you can't go wrong I got a Christmas chocolate elf from Thornton's. If you know me you know that I love Thornton's chocolate and anything shaped weird and wacky and wonderful has my name on it so the next thing she got me was the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara this is like an on-running joke she gets me this like every year for like birthdays Christmas because I swear by this it's my favorite mascara of all time and I run out of it so quickly so she got me a big one this time this gift was a total surprise I had no idea she was getting me it it's the book The Tattooist of Auschwitz I have seen this book so many times when I've gone into Waterstones and as you know I absolutely love books and I've never actually bought myself it and she picked it up for me and I'm so so excited to read this it sounds like a really really good story and yeah look at it look at it I'm so happy with that next was this metal sort of plaque that goes on your wall when I opened this I got so excited if you know me you know that one of my favorite movies of all time is back to the future and to get one of these it's a back to the future one that's gonna go straight on my wall with the rest of them I love them so much and I love Back to the Future so that is an amazing gift, thank you. The final gift she got me is of course from the Disney store and it's a very much an inside joke between me and her. It is a Mushu mug, this is probably one of my favourite presents I got this year. It's got Mushu on the front and on the inside it says the line dragon not lizard i don't do that tongue thing that is like one of my favorite lines from mulan ever mulan is one of my favorite disney films if not my favorite and honestly i say that every time we watch it i'm so happy with that i literally it's it made me laugh so much when i opened it so thank you so much chelsea for all your lovely presents so the next presents have a little bit of an explanation basically i get a main present of my uncle and a main present of my grandparents and then they get me little presents together because my uncle still lives with them so to start off with, this was my main present from my uncle. He got me a Fitbit. I've been after one of these for so long and I absolutely love the blue colour. It it's never left my wrist. I absolutely love it. I'm addicted to it. Thank you so much because I know that these are not cheap so I'm so happy. Thank you. So they're combined presents. I got two DVDs. I got Coco which if you haven't seen you need to. It's one of the best Disney films out there and Mulan too because as I said I love Mulan and I haven't got the second one on DVD so thank you. And some CDs I got George Ezra and Olly Murs. very very happy with those. I got some perfume I got the Aqua Kiss by Victoria's Secret which I've been after for so long it smells so nice so I finally got it and a bottle of Vera Wang Princess. This is one of my favourite favourite perfumes and I wear it so much I run out of it so quickly so I really needed another one so thank you so much for those. They also got me this Friends Trivial Pursuit with which me and my sister have played and I won. My grandparents also got me some earrings and I'm terrible. I haven't even unpacked from coming home yet when I'm filming this. So I can't find the box. I think I put it in my backpack to keep it as like a safe place. But they're basically just like these but a uh, red sort of colour, like scarlet red. And they are beautiful so thank you. They're very Christmassy. The final combined present they got me was this book. It is Noel Fitzpatrick becoming the super vet. Once this came out, I wanted it so badly, but I knew they were going to get me it, so I couldn't have it. But I absolutely love the Super Vet. I think he is freaking incredible, the work that he does. And I'm so excited to read this. Like, uh, I'm so happy I finally have it. Thank you so much for that. That's going to be very, very well read and probably one of the first I'm going to read. He's incredible, man. So my main present of my grandparents is something that I have been after for years. And the fact that I actually have this in my hands right now, I am so, so grateful. It is the Violet Voss Holy Grail eyeshadow palette. Can I get a hallelujah? I, I've been after this for so long. 
I'm gonna show you it because it's freaking beautiful. Rainbow. I mean, look at that. Look how stunning that is. I cannot wait to use it. Honestly, thank you so, so much. I can't even explain it. I've been after this for so long. So beautiful. So a big shout out to Paul and my grandparents for all of those lovely gifts. Thank you so much. You've spoiled me rotting. <laughs> like, it's incredible. So now I'm gonna move on to my parents. Honestly, this year, my parents have spoiled me and my sister rotting. Like, this is the most we've ever got for Christmas. So I have to say a massive, massive thank you. It is incredible. I did not expect any of these presents, considering the main present I got, which I will tell you about, to get any of the extra things is, oh my god, but thank you so much. To start out with, they got me some DVDs I've been after, so 13 Ghosts, The Kiss of the Nun, The Greatest Showman and A Quiet Place. I then got some CDs, I've got I Love the 80s, Pink, Beautiful Trauma, Years and Years New Album and George Ezra, Staying at Tomorrow's. They got me some sweets because they know me so well. Galaxy is my favourite chocolate of all time, so they got me a massive bar. And they got me this retro sort of sweet box. They've got blackjacks, fruit salads, whams, refreshers. Honestly, it's like a throwback. It's like being a child in a box. So thank you for that. That is such a, such a weird but cool present. And then obviously got the vamps calendar. They get me a calendar every year and it's normally the vamps one that I ask for. As soon as I saw this in the shop, I really, really wanted it. So I'm so happy that I can now put it up because it's New Year when I'm bringing this video to you. <laughs> So next I got a few pairs of pyjamas because they know I spend most of my entire life in my pyjamas, like it's not even funny. The first one I got is the Harry Potter bed shirt, it's long sleeved and it's like a purple and blue tartan and I absolutely love this. I love Harry Potter and I love a good bed shirt so that, that will be very well used and it's so comfy. So the second one I got is a complete surprise because the Primark and Preston don't actually sell this one so I've never ever seen it before. But it is a bed shirt with mushu on. Like, you can't go wrong. As I've already said, I absolutely love Mulan. It's one of my all-time favourite Disney films. I can quote, like, every word. And to get Mushu on a bed shirt is just me in a shirt. <laughs> I was so happy when I opened it. I was like, how the hell, where did you find that? I also got an Aladdin one of these. And it's Aladdin and Jasmine on the flying carpet. But I don't seem to know what I've done with it. It might be still in my suitcase. So... Yeah, that exists. <laughs> and the final pair was also a surprise because again, we don't do these in our shop. So these are the trousers, they are blue sort of tartan, but it's all about the top, it's all about the top. It's this sort of luminous orange colour, but it has Dumbo on it. Look at him, he is beautiful. Dumbo is my favourite Disney film of all time, hands down. Anything to do with Dumbo, I am straight there. These are very, very much me and they will be so well worn. It just Dumbo's the cutest little thing, so thank you so much for all of my pyjamas. I love pyjamas. You can't go wrong with pyjamas for me. <laughs> get some clothes. I just got some standard black Topshop jeans, the Joni jeans. You all know about them. They are not cheap, so thank you. I really needed a new pair because my other ones have gone grey, so they are a staple essential. Thank you. got this top. I haven't actually opened it yet, but I was told to pick a top, so I did, and I love this one. It's just a white sort of zip down the front and it's long sleeve and it's got Alessi on the sleeves. I will post a photo once I've actually opened it but I absolutely love this so thank you so much. It's such good quality and I can't wait to wear it. Some little like makeup-y bits. My dad bought me and my sister one of these. It's full of like eyeshadows and lipsticks and sort of like pencils to use and things so thank you so much for that. Oh, also this brush set. He bought one for me, my mum and my sister which is incredible. Look at all those brushes. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I seem to lack eyeshadow brushes a hell of a lot, so I really needed some new ones, so thank you so much. Also, look at the size of this brush. <laughs> Alcohol is a little stocking filler, drink wisely, guys, but it was a little bottle of Kraken and a little bottle of Captain Morgan's, which is my favourite. I love rum, so thank you. It got me so much, like, I can't even take it in. Down. It exists. <laughs> I've been after a lava lamp for so long and I finally have one. I've had it on for a few hours trying to get it to lava and it's finally doing it and look how cute it is and how pretty it is. It's it's so cute. Some books, these are just three of them. I got Susan Hill's Dolly and A Woman in Black. I love her books and I can't wait to read these. Obviously I've seen the film but the book is supposed to be so much better so I'm so excited. And I got Bird Box. Now, 
This is now a Netflix film and I knew about Bird Box when it first came out as book like I've been after it for so long but I didn't want to buy it because I knew my parents were getting me it they specifically said don't get any of the books that you've asked for so I got this and now it's a Netflix film and I'm like do I watch the film do I read the book first let me know what should I do but I'm very excited to read this and compare it to the film I love doing that the final book they got me is a book collector's dream when I opened this I nearly shat like Everything else they've got me is incredible and I'm so so happy but this is beautiful like this it is the complete works of Sherlock it's the comp of Sherlock Holmes but would you just look at that cover it's so beautiful it feels like a leather and the pages are obviously gold and the back's got a key on it and it's just tied it's just such a beautiful book like I've seen this in just a plain sort of black cover with Sherlock Holmes on it and I've never ever seen this version so to get this on Christmas day, I opened it and nearly shat like, it is so beautiful. Like, thank you so, so much. I've been wanting to read this for so long and now I finally have it and I do not want to put it down. They also got me this reindeer dressing gown. Now it's funny because I have picked this out before when I've been in Primark with Beth, simply because it had reindeers on it and I thought it was so, so cute. So they got me this and it's actually really practical because my dressing gown that I have is a bit too short and I needed a new one and this one fits perfect so very very practical thank you so much. Now I love a good game, me and Jonathan play games all the time so my parents got me two games. This is called iTunes, you basically guess the musician and the song off the cards and some of them are really good, we've tried that. And I've got the Sherlock Holmes card game which is a little bit like Cluedo from what I've read but I can't wait to give these a proper try out. I love a good game. Bits and bobs they got me go together and can you guess what they're for? I guess it's just a standard chain for a bike, it's a motorcycle bike chain because it's a lot stronger and I really needed one because what they got me needs to be tied up so so safely. This white crash helmet it's by Melon which if you don't know them they are one of the best helmet makers. They make really really strong helmets and I've been looking at this one for so long and it's just Plain white, just plain white to match the bike. The bike I am not going to hold up and show you on the camera because that would be ridiculous. But it is basically a blue, sparkly, old fashioned Dorothy style bike which I will show you on camera now. absolutely stunningly beautiful I've been after one of these ever since I was little and honestly to finally get one is incredible like I couldn't believe it when they said they had one for me like blow and I've already took her out for a test drive and oh it's just I'm so in love with her she's so beautiful she just stopped riding her to uni and to the gym and ah some celebrations and quality sweets and things off my nana and my granddad and like my parents Everything I got off my parents it is incredible how much they got me. I am so so grateful. Thank you so so much You've no idea what it means to me, but honestly just to be with the family was enough But to get all of this I just absolutely love him So I got a few other bits and bobs of other people so I'm going to show you them I'm going to start with what I got off my boyfriend Jonathan So the first thing he got me is this massive box of Thornton's chocolates I swear everyone's trying to fatten me up this Christmas, but this is incredible like the chocolate tree I'm so happy. He then got me these pyjamas, which I can't show you in the packaging because I wore them around Christmas when I was at home. But they've got little polar bears on them and they got Santa hats on! And they're like a velvety, like, warm kind of material. I don't know how to describe it, but they are so cute and it comes with a long sleeve top as well, which I've also worn. But honestly, thank you so much for them. They are so warm. I've been living in them while I've been at home. <laughs> the final thing he got me was wait for it a dumbo hot water bottle have you ever seen anything so cute in your entire life i struggle a lot with being cold and he knows that because i literally try and steal his heat if that is even a thing so the hot water bottle is going to keep me so so warm and dumbo is my favorite disney thing ever and he's just so cute and it adds to my dumbo collection and he knows that i love dumbo so the fact that he knows that and has gone out and done that is 
is so cute and I'm so happy with them. So thank you so much, Jay, for all of the presents. I absolutely adore them. His brothers very kindly also bought me a gift. They know me way too well. Of course, it is a bottle of none other than Captain Morgan's rum, which is my favorite drink in the entire alcoholic world. I also got a bottle of this off my mom's dad and some money off him, but obviously I'm not going to show that because it came in a card, but yeah, that's what he got me. Jonathan's parents also very, very kindly bought me gifts, so thank you so much. They got me another one of these. It's so funny that both sets of parents saw this and was like, you know what, Amy would love that, let's get her one. So I have two of these, which is amazing because you can't go wrong. They got me another elf like my sister, which is so, so cute because now he has a friend. <laughs> they also got me pyjamas. Everyone knows me so well, I spend half my life in pyjamas. They are these gorgeous ones from Marxies, like honestly, they are so nice when you feel them. They've got like a tartan purple trouser and they've got a long sleeve purple top and they are so cute and it's going to be so nice to lounge in, let alone sleep in, so thank you for them. They will be, they will be well worn. <laughs> and finally, they got me a makeup bag, which is a pug, but if you feel it, it's furry and it's just, oh, I already know what I'm going to put in it, so thank you so much for that. When I opened it, I was so excited. I was I have to feel it. So grateful that they got me presents. They're so cute. His great aunt, who was like 91, also decided to buy me a gift, which is so cute. Like, his family is so adorable. The first thing she got me is this stunning, like, bee jewellery holder, and it's, it's so cute. It's so pretty. She also got me these little flower earrings, which I don't know if they're going to focus or not, but I wore them on Christmas Day and they are so beautiful, honestly. They are gorgeous. This That means so much to me. It's such a cute little present and so happy. Everything's so pretty, so thank you so much. The final present I got was as a secret Santa at work. Uh, we all like spent a fiver on each other and we did a secret Santa and pulled names out of the hat. Now this present I'm so happy with because I actually wanted this and I've seen it myself and was gonna buy it. Again, it's pyjamas, so whoever got me knew that it was like, I love pyjamas. But it is this Winnie the Pooh bed shirt which has honey and Winnie the Pooh on it. And it is like this cream striped color. And it's, it is the cutest. Like, thank you so much to my supervisor, Maxine, which I found out it was her for getting me this. I love it. I love it. So that was everything as far as I'm aware that I got for Christmas. I got so spoiled this year and I cannot even find the words to say thank you. Like, honestly, to everyone who's bought me a gift, the thought that's gone into them, everything. Thank you so, so much. <laughs> I've been saying it throughout the whole video, but it means a lot to me. Just to see my friends and my family over Christmas for me is enough. But to get all this is incredible. So thank you so, so much. I hope you guys had a lovely Christmas with your friends and family and you got some lovely gifts. I hope 2019 treats you all very, very well. If you like this video, please, please give it a massive thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I'm hoping in 2019 I will get back into YouTube. I know I keep saying that, but I really, really want to because I miss it so, so much. So thank you for watching and until next time, guys. Bye.